What's up everyone, this is Ali Talk is Tech, and in iOS 11 you probably noticed that if you go to the wallpaper section in the settings, you'll probably notice that Apple removed all of the live wallpapers except for three. They removed all of the fish wallpapers, so today I'm going to be showing you how you can get the fish wallpapers back on your iOS device if you really like them, and also how to make any other image or video a live wallpaper. So you can see right now, this is the classic fish wallpaper. Let's get started. bit complicated but I will be walking you through it step by step so what you want to do is tap the first link in the description and then from here it's gonna take you to Safari I recommend opening it up in Safari but once it does open up what you want to do is go to tap on open in iZip now open the second link in the description and download this app it will be linked down below so that way it's provided for you so you can actually do this and once you do have the app installed what it will do is it'll automatically just take you through all the files you need just keep tapping on ok and then keep tapping on the live fish wallpaper or at least the live fish folder and just in case you don't know that's what the app looks like so i'm going to go back inside of the app go ahead and exit on that you don't need to pay for this at all but you want to choose the live wallpaper that you want so what you want to do is tap on the actual file to view it and if you want to actually download it, go ahead and tap on the little check and then tap on the save button. So now you just saved it as a video file. So download the third link in the description and it's gonna take you to this app once you've installed it. Go ahead and tap on select video and then from here choose that video file you just downloaded and make sure you crop it so that way it'll actually fit. Go ahead and tap on done. And then from here you can actually choose a really cool filter so maybe you want to add the contrast or increase it or whatever you want to do go ahead and tap on done and then an ad would come up just tap on save and then from here you can go ahead and make sure you go to settings but here you can view the live wallpaper that you just saved but only open it up in settings to actually set it as the live wallpaper make sure you set it as your lock screen and once you turn off the iDevice and turn it back on it might be a little glitchy just because it is iOS 11 but once you do turn it back on you can see I've got this really cool live wallpaper and if you want to get that really cool bounce effect like as if it were the actual one what you can do is swipe up on the live wallpaper and go ahead and tap on bounce otherwise this live wallpaper would not have that cool effect so that's about it for today thank you so much for watching hopefully this does help anyone who likes these wallpapers and as always peace